Hello everybody, this is GamerCat, and welcome to a Terraria series. It's a series of Terraria. I played the um, demo of the game, and I watched a few gameplay videos, but as far as advanced stuff, I'm not really sure. I actually just now got this game. I really was looking forward to playing it. I really just wanted to customize my character. Now, as far as I can tell, there's not going to be any way to make this, per this person look like a cat. Well, what if I just take myself out in orange? That would be fun. <laughs> this looks like I'm in a jumpsuit or something. Look, <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna mess around with these. This might not be the most interesting part. I always, I always skip through this part. When, I always skip through this part when I was watching it on. Let's find some blue eyes for me. Find a hair, hair, hair color. Um. Here, we'll just do that. I look like Elvis. Look at that hair. Look at that. Okay. <sighs> Randomize. No, no, that's fine. Okay. Do I really care that that much about this? I want to go find a new... There. Now, given I really don't care that much about this, it's fine. Oh. Obviously, we'll do that. Let's create a world. Now, what is an expanded world? Want to give me some information? Not going to give me any information on what an expanded world is. Um, I guess expanded would be for multiplayer stuff. Uh, never mind. We'll just do something like this. Mmm. I'm trying to give it a unique name. How do I select this? Create world, normal world, cat, landia. I'm gonna skip through this. Wait, no, wait, I found it. Placing dirt and rocks, making random holes, generating large caves, generating jungle. It's gonna be an interesting game to play, isn't it? Now, I think it's gonna... I'm gonna be playing I'm gonna be playing as this character for a long time. It's probably gonna come back to bite me in the butt, butt that I didn't spend that much time trying to figure out exactly how I wanted it to look. Smoothing the world, that's something about... Um, spider cave... Hornets. Okay. There are floating islands in the sky. I will keep this in mind. What's new? I don't care. Okay. Well, that is loud. Okay, so this is the full version. This is Terraria. Okay, let's just chop down some trees. We're chopping down some trees. Like, everybody would chop down some trees if they decided that they wanted to. If they had an axe and stuff. And hopefully I don't kill that bunny with the axe. I don't know. There's n there's no reason to kill them, I don't think. In the, um, demos, there weren't any reason to kill the bunnies. Their limbs kind of just went flying in a bloody mess. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Hey, should I? It's a moral dilemma. Here, why don't I just kill the bunny for no reason at all? You know what? Never mind. If you if, if if you wanted to see what the the, the um, what it looks like to kill a bunny in this game, you can get the game yourself and do it. I'm gonna go over there and talk to this person. That person over there. What's up? How do I talk to you? Hopefully, I don't kill you. Here, how do I speak? Oh, here it is. Help. Oh. 
Okay. Listen, you're, you're basically telling me everything the tutorial taught me to do. Let's do some exploring. Okay, we have wall, like a little thing to jump. There, we did it. Um... Am I gonna have to build my way across already? Well, I learned how to do this stuff in the tutorial, so it should be fine. Okay. Do... wait, wait. Push into that. Build that thing. Perfect. Now let's build across the chasms. Preferably, like, right here. I am playing this game on mobile, as is already really apparent. Oh, cool, we have some just, uh, what is this, copper? Right over, right down here. Let's make it so we can, um, hop out easily if need be. I'll mine only the ore so we can climb out of the dirt. So, unlike... So, there's actually a really gigantic reason to, um, play, to act, to, um, to, uh, build a base in this game, for, like, a lot, many, many reasons. There's actually a big reason, and I've always wanted a reason to need to eat food in a game like Minecraft. I always, um, always like the survival modes of Minecraft, and I hear that this game is really similar to Minecraft. I can see the similarities, but I also know that it has a lot of unique stuff. And it's really fun. Oh, cool. It's a chest. It's chest. I know this doesn't look like my first game, but it really isn't. I've played the, um, the modes of this game. I've played the demo of this game. That's the free demo. So I could decide if I wanted to play it. And this world is big! In the demo version, you just had, like, a small bit of land to walk across. And then jump off into a pit of lava. This is fun. Okay. Oh, cool, it's a snow biome. Am I gonna catch pneumonias? There, you know what? I'm gonna stay out of this area. There has to be some kind of thing. So. wonder if we should just go right ahead. Avoid the danger house biomes. And just go into... Let's explore in the other direction. Cut down some random trees. Just explore on the map a little bit. I, would, I wish I wish there was a daytime timer thing. Here you could tell what time of day it was. But I, there doesn't seem to be any indications of that in this game. So this is guy's guide, you know? He tells us stuff. Hmm. Oh, there's a mushroom. Mushrooms heal you. Well, how do I know this? I played the demo version of this game. Okay, we got some armored climbing claws. That sounds legit. Can we equip that somehow? Wait, is it like a recipe? It's probably just a recipe for something. Okay, that's slime, slime. Okay. Okay, just kill the slime. They're not really they're really the slimes aren't really that hard to kill. And they give you stuff that you need for your base, so. I'm just trying to look for a flat area. That's f um. I'll just probably deforest this area right here and even it out, and I'll build my base here. And maybe that way the guide can move in and stuff. Oh, see, um, see. Oh, cool. They actually take if they have health bars like that. I wonder if there's any need to kill them. Uh, maybe, but. We're not- we don't seem to be hungry at the moment, so there's not really any reason to kill them. And if they regenerate health, I'd probably just go get the mushrooms for health anyway. Okay, got another slime. I wonder how constantly bombarded I'm gonna be by these things. And I know from my, um, adventures in the demo that there are different color slimes. And there's multiplayer versions of this game, so I might play it with my friends. See, I just told you there's gonna be multicolored versions. Getting to know how to play the game before you actually play the game. I was I get to know I get to know how to play the game before I actually played the game. Oh, I was correct. 
Whoa, the backgrounds are changing. This is the forced area. What's this area? Why is it all crinkly and crackly? Why is it- why- why- why, why does the background sound crinkly and crackly? I mean, yes, the background has, um, has a sound to it. Okay, it seems to be getting darker. It's time to build a base. Wait, I just realized. You, um, you have to find a place that's already clear of stuff. Like, if you dig... Okay, I'll build right here. It's, um, it's fine. Here, okay, well, man, we gotta get down... We gotta get to work on this stuff. I might die, because I... I might die in the nap. I might die because I'm stupid. And I don't make my base. I gotta make a door first. Like, just, just one door. Man, we're gonna have some issues with this game. Mainly because of how stupid I am. Okay. Um. I say we just build our house. I'll, I'll, I'll rough out the edges later. Oh, I gotta walk towards it. Okay. Also, the slimes. Okay, so we'll bring it down here. Man, I should do- I should have done this earlier. Am I gonna die, y'all? I don't think so. Okay, so let's just do some... Trimming. Okay, there. So we basically have this now. You just gotta make some torches. Craft. Place them on the walls. Oh, crap. Are they gonna just come in here because they don't have the stuff? Hey, it's fine. Okay, well, this at least gives me some time to build my stuff. They can't actually break through it, so I'm not even gonna try and kill them. Hmm. Oh, that's right. Man, I keep getting distracted by stuff. Okay, let's see. We have the stuff placed. No, wait, that's right, we need the backgrounds. The backgrounds that we need to make a base. All right. Oh, come on, here it is. Let's build, like, um, I don't know, I'd say, like, 150 of these things. Because it takes a lot. Okay. Oh, wait, crap, wrong thing. Ronge thing, it's the ronge thing. No, I don't want to destroy the door, that's the only thing keeping me alive. I might even go over to pick up that wood, because it's dangerous to walk up to the doors. Drag this over to where that thing is... So you just go in here, and you do this, you make the walls for your base, just like anyone would. Okay, I, that was that was too, too wide. I can uh, fix that later with my hammer I'm about to make. Right now, top priority is making our place inhabitable. And get the guide in here so he can sleep. And be okay, and not die in the night. I mean, I don't really know if um the NPCs that come into your base can die. I mean, I could, I would think they could. Okay, to do this, let's make some walls and survive. Is that good? I think we just need to make a chair, and we should be good for people moving into this place. I think we can make it, like, more appealing so more people will come. This is- this is, okay, let's make it- Oh, sup! I got a dude! Okay, so we'll wait until he comes. I don't know when he's gonna come. And, yeah, that's basically the night. I'll see you guys in the morning.